Here comes the match. <laughs> what is the difference between a will and a trust? And if I have a trust, do I need a will? If I have a will, do I need a trust? Some version, some variation on a theme. I get those questions off. A will is a document that alerts the world. This is what I want to happen to my assets now that I am deceased. I want this person to, mem to be my executor. And I want that person to get my house. And I want this other person to get my brokerage account. Right? That That's what a will does. It is useful and only has force and effect after a person passes away. That's a will. A trust can be a will substitute. If you have a last will and testament and you have a simple plan, if you want to distribute things evenly, three children, three separate ways, two children, two separate ways with certain specific bequests, you can use a will and it can be fine. And if your plan is your idea of how to distribute your assets and your circumstances are simple. A will can be a perfectly valid legal document and sufficient for your needs. And in that instance, you would not need a trust. But do you see how I had a few thoughts ahead of saying, you know, before saying all you need is a last will and testament, I qualified it. So this is a qualified circumstance that if you have a will, you don't need a trust. And it has to be what you want. Conversely, if you have a trust, a trust is a will substitute. It can have present day force and effect, can protect and provide for instructions if you become disabled. And if you have a trust and this is the quali qualification part, qualified answer, if you have a trust and all of your assets have been funded into the trust, placed into the trust while you're alive, then you don't need a will, but it's qualified. And if you do a trust with me, I also make sure that you have a will. It makes sense for any after obtained assets, anything that you might have inherited before you pass away, anything that you may buy or purchase before you pass away that didn't make its way into the trust, I think you need both. And uh, the difference is, well, there's quite a few. A will is required to go through probate and a trust is not required to go through probate. A certain type of trust can be a will substitute and a probate avoidance vehicle. That's it for now. Otherwise, I could keep going and inundate you with information. But I'll give you a little bite-sized, little chunk, little chunklet of information now. And uh, later on, we'll give you little more chunks of information.